A place in the FA Cup third round is at stake as Yeovil get the match underway. And they are quickly on the attack. It's won by Yusuf. And here is Gorman. And it was almost a dream start for the non-league side. Dale Gorman with a precision effort. Reeves is over the free kick. And it's a fine save from Smith. The rebound from Osborne. Tipped away from the goalkeeper. But the flag was raised for offside. But the initial effort would have stood. And Smith made a decent save. Spread by Reeves. It's infield to Osborne. And it's another good save from the Oval goalkeeper. Stevenage, the dominant side at the moment. Stevenage have found it very difficult to score goals away from home. So far this season, knotted down by Reed. Andrade. A more comfortable save for the goalkeeper this time. But Stevenage continuing to impress. Melbourne with the free kick, and it's very deep, and it falls to Prosser. And he blazes too high. Another chance for Stevenage. Yeovil pump it long, and it breaks to Staunton! And he went for the curler. And Yeovil not creating too much in this first half. Elliot List has been on the fringes of the game, but he's found Andrade. And that was not his best option. And as we approach half-time, Stevenage wastes another opportunity. And the clearance out is played back in field by Worthington. Low Everton. And he's picked out Wakefield! Charlie Wakefield for Yeovil. And the non-league side are ahead. Steven is looking to play the ball out. And it came straight back very quickly. Low Everton with the assist. And Wakefield, the former Chelsea youngster, with a very tidy finish. And after Stevenage's first half pressure, it is Yeovil who take the lead. Taylor. And he's found Osborne, and the cross is somehow repelled. It was a brilliant block from Dan Moss. Now Reed, could this be the opportunity? No! Another good save from Grant Smith. Yeovil were careless, and Reed almost made them pay. Yeovil, so close now. Here is Worthington, great delivery. Nobody on the end of it, but Yeovil are heading through. It's an FA Cup shock here in Somerset.